welcome back to my channel. It is April new me if you are new, but if you're one of my subbies, hey you too, bestie. And there goes the gardener. Never fails when I want to film. Excuse the gardener, sorry about that. But I wanted to hop on here and just share with y'all. Before I get into that, y'all already know that we live in this apartment and we got an extra bedroom because the plan was to have a home office. We were gonna split it down the middle. Half was gonna be for my spouse who worked outside of the home and the other half, majority of the half was going to be for me for YouTube studio. Well, the cooties have ruined everything and now my spouse primarily works from home. She telecommutes. With her job, and it's a government job, she cannot share spaces. We cannot share an office for proprietary information. So I have been kicked out of said office, y'all. So basically, I have this little area behind the couch where I do most of my filming anyway, but this is just gonna be my little area to do my YouTube stuff, to edit, to have a dedicated area that's not my dining room because I hate that, to get my stuff together, to get my stuff done. So what we're going to do today, I'm gonna turn the camera around and I'm going to go ahead and organize this cute little cart that my spouse got me for one of my Christmas gifts. We're gonna do all the organization. We're gonna clean a little bit and we're gonna put stuff away and try to make this somewhat a creative workspace. We'll see what happens, but I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera around and we'll get started. It's in my birthday, yeah, cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third And the rest of it Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third And the rest of Don't look, they're like everything that has a cherry on top Get on my 
for someone who can play though Wanna hang with me I'm not really looking for a friend so Spend your time with me Looking for someone not afraid of Give it all to me Get next to me, get next to me All that I want is to get next to you, get next to you Not asking for much but it feels like the two of us are gold and our gold You see, what do you got so take a chance, take a chance on me It's magical when you are close, so get close, babe What do you got cause I am gold and I'm golden You're not really looking for a friend As you saw, I got all my supplies out, organized them the best I could, and now I'm going to take you through each tier of the cart. Only other thing I have to do is show you my little traveling makeshift desk, and I'm going to clean up. You can see all this stuff here on the floor. And then your girl is done. Um, it is about three, um, which gives me time to tidy up the living room and then start dinner. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and I'm gonna take you through each tier of the actual. So starting at the top tier, this is actually my favorite part of the actual, let me move this, of the actual cart. This is the reason why I wanted this cart opposed to the very popular one that everyone gets with the deeper compartments. I like this little wood top. One, cause it's functional. If I ever need to sit down on the couch, I can write on this, use this as my desk if I honestly really wanted to, which I have already. And the other reason is because it comes off and you can contain things. I did try, you can put this actual wood top on any of the three tiers, but I just like it on, on the top part just because if I ever again wanted to use it as a makeshift desk, I honestly could. I like to put my planners in here, my iPods in there, my clipboard, and I think there's, yeah, there's graph paper underneath. These are all my planners. And I just like to have it in there, one, so they don't get dusty if I don't pick them up every day, two, because I am clumsy and I spill my coffee and tea a lot. Yeah, so I just like having that there. I do want to keep my main everyday planner right here on top because I do reach for this throughout the day, probably like four or five times throughout the day I write or look in my calendar. So I like to have this on top. And then we we'll go to the yeah, second. And, oh, it took a little bit too much to get down here. But anyway, so we are on the third tier. Now I wanted to use this area like as planner central. Basically everything that I usually reach for when I plan is on the middle space. So y'all saw that I put all my washi tape on these hooks, which I think is brilliant. I saw this on Pinterest. I'm also going to use this for my headbands. If y'all know me in real life, I have a headband, every color, every pattern. So these will go great. I'm gonna use for those. And I'm also gonna give a few for Tony for her hair ties. These are my most reached for pens and pencils and my stylus, my rose gold. Y'all know I love rose gold. Um, it's in there. These are, I just wanted these readily available. So if I am on this tier writing or whatever, boom. Here go my pens. These are my most used tools. Just basic scissors, hand hole punch. I am very extra and I use this to cut said washi tape and stickers if I need to. And there is a roller whiteout. These are all my stickers right here. These are the post-its from Lizzie and Liv. Shout out to them if you watch my brown sugar. Okay, so I just wanted to give y'all a better look. Um, these are the affirmation and motivation sticky notes and they come in this little cute little cardboard case, but here they are. This is also from Liv and Lizzie. It's a post-it. You have line paper sticky notes, the long ones, these little tabbed ones, and and I love that they're all together. I also like to have like a little notebook. A lot of my meetings that I have for Black and Soul, which is the business I have with my spouse, a lot of YouTube, you know, brainstorming goes on in here. So I like to have that readily available. 
So I just like how everything is contained in one area. It doesn't have to be super cute, but I just wanted it everything canile together. So when I plan, I'm not looking for stuff. This is my little speaker. Um, shout out to Nick, Sunkiss Nick. She gave this to me as a present in our gift exchange. One of the presents she gave me. She gave me so much great stuff that I use for my channel. But I like to listen to music or sometimes I'm watching a show or something like that. So I just Bluetooth it from my phone to the speaker. You saw my pencil case. I like to have all my pens. I have a lot of these pens and I bought a whole thing. Girl, if y'all haven't got this Sharpie pen, and it's like my favorite pen, I love these though. What is it, the Pilot? The Dr. Grip Pilot Gel Pen. These will smear on some paper, but it just glides on the paper. I know I sound like a nerd for like loving pens, but these are the pens and pencils and stuff I have extra. Just wanted to keep it out of sight. I also have some color pens in there, a little, the little itty bitty post-it note. Things that like I need, but might not need, but I don't want roaming around. I did have the color pens in here, but I don't reach for them that much. And plus I just don't like things to look cluttered. So I have much rather have them tucked away in the pencil case i was trying to put these in their child but they didn't fit but that's okay if they just float on top it just looks more organized this way i always have an extra block and usb port in case anything needs to be charged i always have a little thing of lotion of some sort you know when you write a lot or you're reading a lot if you work with paper period you know your hands get ashy and dry so i just like to have this here it's hydrating these are my most used tools of sort we already talked about the washi this area is not that pretty but it's just again functional this is like tools that i don't reach for a lot this is my snowball microphone all of the voiceovers you hear are from this shout out to my best friend miranda she gave this to me for my birthday one year i have the rest of the months in my planner my old cover for my planner those hooks this is extra stylus i just didn't want to throw this away so i just tucked the keys away to the um I don't know why you need a keto pencil box child but whatever stuck the keys in there and then back there is my six hole punch and this is literally all of my supplies this was like on the corner of the couch half of this was back here i just love that it's all together everything is symmetrical it's functional it's cute so i have everything child i know you're all like girl it's a tray girl it's not just a tray okay because this is my desk i literally sit on that bean bag put it here I have to vacuum and all this stuff but i usually sit on that bean bag have my desk there drink my morning coffee if you guys have ever followed me on instagram you see my morning little shots the coffee mug is usually right up there the reason why i got this is for a couple of reasons first off it's black it's bulky and sturdy i did not want something flimsy i didn't want something that would last me for like a month or two this is heavy y'all like i know it doesn't look like it but this is super heavy i like how it has this little pocket i don't even know what i have in here also like this let me get my other cell phone so i can have the phone in there it sits up perfect i also have this sometimes if i want to watch a show or if i'm on a zoom call with you i will put my ipad in this and it'll be set up just like that like I love this. This works with your iPhone too, but it's very heavy and sturdy. It was made for an iPad. But another reason is because it has a built-in mouse pad. And also, wait for it. It has a daggone jaw, y'all. Like stop playing. You notice that there's this little piece of wood sticking out. I can't do it one-handed. Hold on one second, I'll show you the other feature. But another feature of this desk was this. Basically, if I ever wanted to use this, like if I drew or if I did graph work or anything like that, I could use this little hook and the desk sits up like this. So again, if I wanted to draw, do graph work or, you know, whatever, if I wanted to plan, I can move it upright. And what can I put in here? Let's put the iPad and it holds it in place. This is also good. Um, sometimes I do this for my laptop if I'm sitting on my bed or my couch and I'm sitting against the pillows and, you know, you want to type, you have to keep your wrist a certain way, you don't want carpal tunnel. This is a great, great, great feature. It has three different levels, so it can go up a little higher or go a little lower. This is the medium. Level. But it feels like the two of a circle,